Hello. Hi, welcome to the van. And this is the front area. We obviously have um, all three seats here are for our dining area. Um, all three seats are on a swivel. Uh, so that's kind of nice. Obviously it makes it easier to actually have a conversation with someone <laughs> when you're looking at them. Uh, we have a fantastic table here, nice and solid, beautiful light edge. Um, it's also on a pedestal that can come, you know, either be brought down and the, the table can, top can come completely off as well. So that's nice too for if you need more space. Um, and how so about the fridge? The fridge over here, yeah, it's actually a pull-out fridge, uh, more like a cooler as opposed to just a, um, a typical fridge that you might find in some bands anyway. Um, we did that because we wanted more. We wanted more uh, ability to store a lot more food and booze. <laughs> <laughs> and it works extremely well. It actually has Bluetooth and everything. You can turn it on and off uh, from outside the van if you use the, um, the app. Um, it locks in place here, very easy. Um, we need to stop. <laughs> so that's our fridge. Um, up here, you will find in our bulkhead, we keep our screens for keeping the bugs out, as well as all our room darkening um, shades for all the windows. They fit extremely well. And up front here, we also have our smart hub for the Victron, Victron Energy. So it tells you basically all of our systems and the status of them all, um, how much we're bringing in through the solar up top, etc. As well as our fresh water tank, which is a 52 gallon tank. It's fantastic. And here we have our kitchen, our favorite. Um, so we have live edge wood. We thought that would be beautiful to decorate this gorgeous area. We have some lovely hanging wine glasses that never break because they are on little foams. Anyway, um, our awesome sink. We love to have the sprayer. It's very nice, it's super convenient. And then we also have our wonderful deep sink quite well and it's nice to have this cover because then it gives us more counter space sure we all know we need that in a van um, one of my favorite parts of this kitchen is the stovetop which are three Furion burners and they work extremely well they can fit nice size pans as well as our awesome what oven, oven. Wait, I would I would pull out the cookies but I'm not baking them right now. <laughs> <laughs> so next so next, above the third seat, we have one pantry. Um, this is one of two. We have a maximized space, but we do use it a lot for food as well as charging and toilet paper, <laughs> just in case we need it. Um, another uh, spot for charging, uh, we have an outlet right here. We have uh, multiple uses for it, as well as our light switches for up top. We have one in back and one here, just so it's easy to turn on the lights no matter where you are in the, in the space. Here's our little spice rack, which we are not was is not in use. That's all right. It's nice to be able to nice use it. Nice live edge wood backsplash. Very pretty. And then our next pantry is right here. We use it for food and to store coffee maker, toothbrushes, and of course, all the things we eat with. Can't forget that <laughs> wine. <laughs> I mean, those wine glasses. Okay. <laughs> and in case you're wondering, yes, we did put it in the bathroom. A very large one, in fact. Oh. This is a nice roll-up floor. Oh, that's awesome. It's actually um, made to resist bacteria and fungus. Here we have our shower. It's super easy to use. A nice toilet. You can actually sit on that when you're um, when you're showering. Shave your legs, all the all the things. We put in two more hooks just for our storage for our towels. And above, they put in a wonderful feature. I absolutely love this. This is mountain range. Um, and it also works well in case you need, you need to dry one more towel. <laughs> Under the sink, we do have gray waste, a nice size t uh, tank. You just literally take it out and dump it. And that's where we hide our um, pots and pans as well. And there's a nice little rack for excess cleaners. So next we have the back of the van. Um, it's upper bed and lower bed for storage space. 
My idea for this was to kind of separate the two. Um, if you didn't want to put up the shades for the night, you can always just close this. Also, just because it gives us privacy because we do have a three-year-old who naps sometimes. <laughs> so here we have the area for our daughter who gets to sleep down here. And this also doubles as a large storage space. And we also have all of the running systems for the van in there. Okay. Next we have our bed. Oh. It is almost a queen size. We are just an inch or two shy of that. Um, so we find great comfort in that while still having tons of storage for clothes, etc. So up top we also have this max fan which is fantastic for venting. We leave just this fan on when we're cooking or um, showering. That's one nice thing about this open space up here is it just vents right out. Coming back here, we actually have so much storage in this area um, while still not give, t giving up too much of our bed space. Oh, we got a safe We have too. a safe. That's cool. Which is very nice. We found these tubs to work well enough for our uh, storage needs for clothing, etc. Um, and we have two, obviously, two over, overhead like, spaces and two lower spaces that are open that are nice to get to. Okay. Um, we have some reading lamps, which are really nice. They're soft touch. Um, you can dim them. And they also have USB underneath them so that you can charge your phone. I'll get out of the way so you can see this wonderful um, ledge as well. I use it every night for all of my things. I love <laughs> the carpentry work in here. It's gorgeous. But if you want to come over here... Okay. I can also turn on the heat from bed. This will um, allow me to set the temperature of the heater, and you can also just set it on an, an automatic setting that'll just turn on whenever you want it to. As Welcome to the back of the van. Now, this is something that we actually are really, really excited to show you, and it is because we love skiing. And this is why, one of the main reasons we went with the RNA's built. Um, they, he designed, um, a nice storage rack for skis here. You can actually fit at least three adult uh, sets of skis. We have a heater right in here that helps dry your boots uh, and your skis after skiing. There's a nice water spigot here for if you're, you know, if you're off the beach and you want to hose everything off before you, you get in and you don't want everything sandy inside. And we have a water protected outlet, which is nice in case you have that need as well. Uh, this little doohickey here actually helps us open our awning, which is massive. Mm -hmm. Next, we have, of course, the back of the beds. This is like, and that's why we gave up a little bit of space on the bed. Well worth it in the long run. Absolutely. Um, this, is this is Catalina's little bed. bed. And when her bed is down, we still have storage in here. Oh, that box back there, as you can see, um, is the gas. So we can actually have our, for our gas stove that is uh, but while Catalina's bed is down we still have tons of extra storage for toilet paper uh, we put you know cans and any dry dry goods that we might need to put in here we can put beach chairs etc there's lots and lots and lots of space here it goes the entire length of the bed and it closes ever so nicely now is her bed fixed or does it go away oh no 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 sir you see if she's not with us we just tuck it right on up, and now you can uh, put your Whoa. bikes in here or whatever so you need. So this whole area converts to storage. Yep. It's quite large. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with all the space. <laughs> it's fantastic. That's pretty great. <gasps> oh, hey! You just caught me. <laughs> I was going to go upstairs and hang out on this cool platform we have up here. What? This is a rocking system. <laughs> See, we have this platform up here, and Catalina and I come up and hang out all day. I want to see. Can I see it? Well, I don't know. Can you get up here without falling? <laughs> I can try. Oh, yeah. And we have solar. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs>